Okay. All right. Looks like we're back. Nah, it wasn't refresh time, but it did go down. Lost my Wi-Fi, but I'm back. <coughs> and we're back, just waiting for uh, Lippy to return. She uh, walked off while I was trying to connect. Good, good, good. We are connected. And temporarily waiting for Lippy to return. I'm not sure exactly. Here she comes. All right. I got it. We're back. Yeah. Ready here. I don't know where he went. <laughs> okay, live streaming for dummies. Come on over. Okay, here comes Jerome. I discovered that this morning. 
I connected my Wi-Fi hotspot to my 4G phone, and my feed was worse. So, um, if you have a 3G phone, it's very much different. Yes. Yes. Okay. Um, I had that with Jay Rod. He hung out by me because he had a 3G phone, and um, he was able to get a good screen. So, you create your YouTube account. You're best doing this at home on a, or someplace else, or like a, you know, on a laptop or a PC. Um, and yes, I am. Yeah, I will, and I got Mac too. All right. Um, you want to do this on a computer because you got to accept the terms of service when you sign all your rights away and all that kind of stuff, and they may not put you out unless you accept the privacy policy. So it's good to do that someplace else. But you can try doing it from your phone right now. I don't know how that will work. Okay, so you sign up for your account on Ustream.tv. Um, and now you can download from your like marketplace, the app thing, where you download apps, you download Ustream. That's what you do. If you've got an iPod or, or an iPad, you download it from the Mac app thing. If it's a Droid, you just go to your marketplace and do it. Okay? Then, once that's done, you just like push on the Ustream thing, which I could show you now, actually, but um, maybe I'll show you afterwards if anyone wants to see. And you hit Go Live. And like this amazing thing happens, it says, you are now broadcasting live. <laughs> this will go to your Ustream account, which will have an address like ustream.tv slash channel slash Joe. Or in my case, I think it's slash, I don't remember what it is. But um, <laughs> you can just hear stop motion solo slash stop motion solo. So it's whatever you need. Okay? And you are live. Okay, that is how I got started. Just holding my Android phone. Now, since the better. Oh, no, no, no. We have not gotten the other Now, Android phones have notoriously terrible batteries. Who here has an Android phone? Does your battery suck? Yes, battery suck. Okay. Shush, shush, shush. First thing, you can get an extended battery for your uh, phone, which will help you in your everyday life. It will only help you a short time. Okay, yeah, yeah this comes next. It will only show you're very good. This might be like my display. It will only show will help you a little bit. Ultimately, you will want a battery pack. They come in a variety of different sizes and different prices. Um, for about fifty dollars, you can get one that's smaller than this. Um, that will get you a good six hours of stream. Okay, um, and they work. They work great. They're very good. However, if you are going to have a marathon day, which sometimes happens, okay, it happened to him on the month anniversary. My smaller battery died. He was there till one in the morning. I went home. Big mistake. So I upgraded to the bigger battery. This is the holy grail of chargers. This will charge anything. Your laptop, your cell phone, your phone, your camera, you know, anything. Um, you just charge it up the night before and I'm good to go till as long as I can stay awake, this thing will stay awake. Um, so that, we're already on to that last page of other stuff you'll need. So let me back up a little bit. How much is that? The big one is about 150. There are other brands. I use the Energizer Universal Adapter. And the reason I learned about this, I don't know if Tim pulls around, but on eviction day, Tim's battery was dying. Some crazy lady in New Jersey calls in order to JNR and had some guy named Jake Rostrom run the battery to Tim Pool. That was me. <laughs> what the hell did I know that I'd be owning one of these things? Anyway. Um, if you've got your iPad or your iPhone, you download that from the App Store. Um, there are instructions on here. You basically push go live and you go live. Um, once your stream has started, you can do interesting things. Like if you've seen people put out like uh, little quizzes and stuff, not quizzes, uh, uh, votes, polls on stuff. I've never done that. <laughs> you can mute it, you can do other, you can do all kinds of things, but I don't know how to do any of that. So I just stream, and I, I, everybody's different. Yes. Um, every once in a while, I save. Um, I, I save about every 45 minutes, and does that archive it? Yes. As soon as you save it, it archives it to uh, UStream. Okay. As soon, it, it archives it to UStream, or if you're using live stream. Um, right. Because these folks here live stream a lot from a laptop. That's why you don't need to be as mobile. As so actually, they can answer questions about better, more questions about live stream than I can, because I'm using Ustream. Even though, if I had a lot of viewers, I would start getting charged. So I, being part of a media team, is very cost-effective. My friends at Occupy Earth, 
grab my Ustream and put it out on Oxy Player, which is a premium live stream channel, no commercial, and you can have a really nice chat and all that kind of stuff while watching me. And you can still say stuff to me. Okay, grab your hands out, guys, in the back. You're welcome to. If I may clarify for a second. Yes, good clarification. Oh, uh, live stream will give you a free account of 30 people, 30 of your viewers, uh, mail the live stream contact team, and, and request that you get a free account. They will upgrade your account to premium so that you don't have ads, banner ads, commercials, things like that for free. You do not necessarily have to pay for it if you get enough of a follow. -up. Right. That's right. Very good. That is, in yeah. fact, how we got our live stream channel, as right. our, our, our followers did that. We didn't know about numbers. They just did it it's, on... It's about 30 people. Uh, Occupy Tacoma did it that way. We okay. They did it on, our own, on their own for us, so... <laughs> All right. Got another question. Is there a limitation to how much stuff is stored? I think there is. On Ustream, it will allow you to store up to 10 gigabytes. Um, how many minutes is that? It's hard to say. 10 gigabytes, I... I did two long streams, two two long days, and that took up over half of it. And uh, yeah, so the thing is, uh, once once you have it on UStream, you can upload it all to YouTube and then delete it from UStream. You don't need it there anymore. So that's the way I do it. Now, now that may be a mobile live streaming issue. I, I'm sorry to cut you off. That the storage capacity may be a mobile live streaming issue, but we found on our laptop that we seem to have a, a bottomless capacity for storage. We have lots of videos streaming and archived uh, episodes of our show we've done and various other things. So yeah, Without a premium account, though, we can't upload more than 40 videos in one day. That's all right. All right, 40 so videos. Then you're, the premium Without a premium account, we cannot upload more than 40 videos in one day. I remember that. So you don't have a premium Which I don't right now, yeah. 40 videos. 40, 40 videos. Yeah. A day. And, you know, I had to wait until the next day. But did they also have a, an upper limit. And I don't know that you've reached it, but there is one. <laughs> we have a lot of material. Right, let me go on and do this, and then we're going to do questions and answers, okay? Um, frequently asked questions. Where did I get my press badge? Well, you can get a job with the press, or you can find a friend who's very gifted on the computer who will make you a press badge. It can have your name on it. It can have the name of your channel. If you decide that you want to become a new streamer with Occupy Earth, maybe we'll make you a patch. But anyway, that's how you do it. This is an Occupy Earth press patch. Does it work? Sometimes, sometimes not. I've gotten past police brag at times. Um, other times I've gotten past and then gotten kicked out. It depends on where you are. I've been you know, to a lot of different cities, so I get past a lot, yeah. Um, I'm very polite and nice about it. I got to ask a couple weeks ago when they weren't letting anybody through. I, I actually volunteered to be arrested. I have to say that there, there is an official New York City press pass. However, if you're wearing a press pass, they are generally going to treat you like media, unless they have some reason not to. <laughs> right, right. Okay. Um, what is the best smartphone for streaming? I don't know. I just got the phone that was on sale. It's a droid one, bionic, yes. and it's actually larger than most, and that's because I have a, a slight disability in my left hand, so the larger phone helps me not drop it and helps me push the button. But I think there are some that are better than others. You've got to check, like, I don't know, memory, well, video card, I don't know, something. Uh, the, the, the iPhone has a reputation as a yes. better picture. Yeah, the iPhone gives you a better picture, for sure. Now, the last page here is stuff you may want or need. Now, we've already covered one of them, and that's the battery pack. And that was the first thing I got after the phone itself was the battery pack. Um, because even with an extended battery here, it just gives you a couple hours, and you don't want to run out of battery. Um, but there's more than that. Um, this long thing here is called a monopod, right? We all know what a tripod is, stand still. Monopod you walk around with. This is helpful for two reasons. One is more stable, so you're not jumping around as you walk. And the other is, if you are vertically challenged, as I am, you can stream from very high up. Where you can climb things. You can climb things, but I can't do that because I'm old, <laughs> and it will hurt. So I don't do that. <laughs> um, these things are not expensive. You can get them on eBay cheap. Mine, I see, is about $39 for it to rotate and swivel. Um, now, here's the clincher. If you have an iPhone, you can just stick your iPhone on the monopod. However, if you have a Droid phone, you can't. You need an adapter. 
And that's this thing here that's holding my phone to the monopod. Um, you, you, you will need an adapter for an iPhone as well. You need an adapter for an iPhone too, according to MacDale. So uh, this is the one I actually tried too. One was $5.99 on Amazon and it broke in less than two minutes. Um, the spring flew out scared my dog, which is not hard to do, but um, then I got this better one at B&H. It works great, and it, my, again, my phone is larger than most, and um, it pulls it, so you want that. Um, the other thing that I found I wanted, when you get one of these battery packs, it comes with, wait, Sean, if, in the top of this, there should be a cord like this. I think it's there. You can do it, Vanna. I will smack you <laughs> with the cord. All right. When you buy your battery, it will come with the thing that connects your phone to the battery pack. Only it's not that long. And if I wanted to extend my pod all the way up, it wouldn't be high enough. So you want to get a bigger one. So now if you go and ask at the store for a bigger one, a longer one, they won't know what to a monopod. They won't know what you're talking about. But ask them for something for a tripod and they will. Go figure. So this is the standard one. And then this is the super big one that's like 60. So this is a 10-foot one available online for iPhone. Okay, yeah. All right. The other things, okay, one is a light source. I'm not carrying a light source now. You only need a light source when it's really dark. Um, I did actually buy one. I haven't used it yet. Some phones have lights on them. Some phones have lights on them. I have a light I can attach. It is an attachable light. I got a light that will attach <coughs> to the phone. I also got a bicycle light that I could have worn on my head. It looked really stupid. But luckily, my friend Mouse, who is not here, but some of you may know, um, he just wrapped it around the monopod and we used that. But I didn't really need it. I haven't used it yet, and we'll see. But the last thing is actually very important, and it's how to carry your stuff. Um, I am a middle-aged person. I have neck problems, back problems. I get tired. I tried just going out with a pocketbook, pain and suffering. So it was worth investing in a real backpack. Not, not a real backpack, a camera backpack. And it's just a lightweight. Any backpack would work, but if you're back in Mexico, pick one that really fits you properly and pick one that's lightweight. So that's what I did for that. Um, final tip. Stop, save, refresh, and restart at least once an hour to prevent from going down. Sometimes I go down all the time. It really sucks. It's also easier to save your videos when they're smaller. <laughs> That's right. Yes. It's too easy. The yeah. jokes there are just too easy, Liv. Yes. It's just okay. going down a lot, yeah, and I it really sucks. I, I just, what? These people understand these things. So I can do it. Okay. <laughs> yeah, we understand it. She just important. does it. The other reason Stop this it. product is important is that it's going right to march. When you want to scream the march, you're going to have to walk backwards. But if you have a monopod, you can scream like this, and that walks backwards, which is way safer. Um, <laughs> I can that because I walked backwards once a long time and anyway, it wasn't fun. Um, carry water, which I, we have water someplace here. Usually. Always Usually. carry some water because you would be amazed at how starving and thirsty you can get. Um, well, listen to that. We have water. There we go. See? Back. We have water. Um, also, and this is one where I fail, stay aware of your surroundings. You're talking, you're talking to people and you're looking at people. You're not paying attention to what's going on around you. And that's what your buddies are there for. Um, there was a day we were at the party. The park was surrounded by people standing about a piece of park. Max said to me. So I just became aware that we're surrounded by police. They moved in closer. That's how you know. You need your buddies. And it's a good, really good reason to like actually stay sober and not be completely wasted or anything like that when you're streaming. Or whenever you're on the time. Um, keep your wits about it. And, you know, so if you notice crowd and police changes, you will do your best work when you stay out of the hospital and out of jail. Yes. yes. So, so, in other words, don't live in the stream? Do not live in the stream. Live in the Bring stream. a smart person to direct you and show you where the hell to go and what's going on. And then Bring a buddy. To them when they yeah. And listen to them. Or like a guy like this that plucks you out of the crowd when you're about to get trampled. <laughs> hey, do your best. Any questions? Oh, God. She's got her own safety crew. <laughs> right. Also, what's the thing? Thank you for um, holding my sign. I am from Occupy Earth. Um, I have cards. If anybody wants to start being used to me, you can be in touch with us. We'll put you in touch with us. And you'll uh, be famous like us. <laughs> uh -huh. Famous, infamous, whatever. Like Scott Motion Solo and Max Dale and Shrubbers from Tacoma and
Quit giving us nicknames for people. Oh. Hey. <laughs> I don't want people to know me um, as um, Strawberry. One thing, I'm not sure if you mentioned this. Oh, yep. Um, when you're streaming, just because uh, this caused a lot of trouble with other live streamers, um, if you're in like a big march, stream whatever you can. But if you're like, in something like this, and someone says they don't want to be streamed, right. don't right. stream them in. I don't know if you said that. Right? Yeah, absolutely. No, I didn't say no, you're right. absolutely like, good. Because uh, sometimes like, there's issues like on like with, when you're in public space, like theoretically it's like you know it's, it's in public space, whatever. But at the same time, people, some people don't want to be on stream. Granted, there might be other cameras watching, whatever. But at the same time, like uh, I know Tim pulled on a lot. They he, he went through a lot of crap because he started streaming people when they didn't want to be streamed. Um, I don't really, I'm not, I don't have any beef against people, I'm just saying that was an example right. there. Um, but if you're in a march, my feeling is there for legal purposes, <laughs> saying everything you can. Otherwise, um, if, if there's something going on, they put something over the face because you can't censor in real time. Yeah, you're absolutely right. Um, and I always do. If someone says, oh no, I don't want to be seen, I don't want to be seen. Right. And in the march, I, you know, I do. The other thing is, when you're <laughs> okay. at a crowd like this, and we're all friendly and support each other, as much fun as it is to hang out, We're learning. Yeah, we're doing our best. Better and better. First, a lot of times it was me and my friend Mal. Um, and then it's just grown. Matt got out here, and now my niece is here, and I got Rob and Sean here. My son's also, coming. I mean, like this guy over here. I know him from chatting, but I know that if I need help or anything, like I have Rick, he will help me. You know, you all know that my friends are occupied. Actually, at times, there are perfectly good reasons to be streaming those sorts of activities, uh, especially when you're dealing with provocateurs or prevent potential provocateurs. Yeah. As in this specific case, one of the individuals that was arguing and picking a fight, I later saw over here Buddy Buddy chumming up with the local park service. Oh, really? So. But make no mistake, if you have provocateurs in the crowd, there are plain clothes police that like to join the crowd. Yeah. Um, and other people who are not plain clothes police that like to be there are trolls everywhere. Those people that don't want to be streamed, <laughs> he'll stream anyway because he knows they're just care. trying to start trouble yeah. and he wants to make them uncomfortable so they go away. You have no expectation of privacy in public, PD or public, none whatsoever. If you're in the public, you do not have any expectation of privacy. I will be civil with people and not stream them if they don't want to be streamed. Fair enough. But if you start acting a fool, I'm going to be on you. I'm a little bit more of an aggressive streamer, though, so don't yeah. follow my lead necessarily. Fair enough. <laughs> Fair enough. In fact, on the, on the march over here, there was we the whole march got held up briefly by a troll. Yeah. Uh, you know, and it, it was counterproductive for the entire march. Oh, actually, um, very counterproductive. I also, it's worth noting. Um, always, a big thing, a big reason I started streaming was, you know, obviously, you know, document things, but also for legal purposes. Right. Absolutely. Case, yeah, and even MLPD. However, when we were on that march, I don't know if he was, I don't know if he was paid by the MLPD or not, but the guy who was, um, following all the occupiers there, actually was pulled away, and the police made a wall between him and the occupiers. The police actually stand up for that. That's worth noting. That was, that was, I didn't quite see that. That's good to know. This is from D.C. Rob. Who wants to know? Now that I am a celebrity in the live streaming world, are more men throwing themselves at you? <laughs> the answer is no. Oh my god, I think back to you. I might have just thrown <coughs> I'm just checking. Oh, he's checking. No, he's thinking he's <coughs> so. 
Well, you've got the ten foot stick to beat him off with. No, 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 I think it, I think it should also be noted that the police don't like you to stream them. The police do not like well, you to videotape them. They will tell you it's illegal. They will tell you that you need they to put it away. Them. They will take your camera from you. That's it is lie. not illegal to film the police officers. Do not listen to that. The film them lie. anyway. Also, they don't need to lie. Yes, they do. And also, you are under no obligation at all, unless you're in jail, to give any to give your, to give any kind of personal information at all. And you don't have to get your right. retina scan. That's yeah. right. I do. I personally like to take pictures of the of the name badge numbers and names just to just absolutely. To, okay. You walk up with a camera, every cop will turn their back okay, on you. They, they, they do not really want hard. to be streamed any more than try it out it's for the most part. Yeah, what is your badge yeah. number? Even if they want to take pictures, you can't film it. They will say it. Sometimes they cover it up when they're really doing their badge. I actually had one say, get it right. So you never know. Yeah. <laughs> but do not let them tell you you cannot take no, a picture or film them or stream them. That is a lie. Whatever yeah. they say, you can't do. You probably can't. Problem. And, yeah. and if you notice, the more cameras on the police, the better they act. Absolutely. Absolutely. Well, at, at that point, it's safety. Yeah. You know what I mean? If you can prevent somebody from getting hurt because you have a camera in your hand, then by all means. Mm-hmm. Even if it's not on. Even if you're just yeah. faking it. Yeah, yeah. Absolutely. Fake it. Well, you don't know. <laughs> you know what he did? Fake it. They don't know. That's right. <laughs> There's a question. There was money in the bank. Was equipment purchased to make this, to make have more people running out with this kind of equipment? Uh, I, I believe some people. I believe some people were lucky enough to receive donations for live streaming equipment. Yeah, yeah. Occupy Seattle got uh, a bit of equipment too, as well. What happened? What happened to all the stuff? The the, ba- the batteries. The, we go, oh, it's all trash. Yeah, most of it got trashed by the police. Yeah, they haven't been able to build it up since. Well, I have to say right now. Yes, we can. Yeah. So I can tell you that there are a lot of people that want to stream here because about forty dollars a month. If I was to add, just as you know, from friends, they could stream on their phone. To add that to my family plan, which is $20. Uh, phone itself is actually cheap. But can I afford it? It's, it's, the, da- it's the data plan. Right, the data plan. And the yeah, so you have to be ready to spend some money. There's no question. How much money does one need to put out to do the data plan? How much money does one need to put out to do it right now? If you have the phone or anything. You don't have anything. You don't have anything. Um, what's okay, the best let's phone say how much it was. How much would it cost for me to start out? I recommend the iPhone because it generally has the best picture. Um, but it is the most expensive. The, I, the iPhone is probably the best picture. I'd say though, personally, I'm probably just going to keep getting droids because I don't like it when I can't take out the battery and I can't change the memory card. And iPhones, you can't, you can't, fit, you're stuck with what you have. With the droid, you can take, you can put a new, if they have four megabytes, you can put in an eight megabyte card in there. It is the map. So, I have a 64 I mean, gigabyte. Don't fit. In there? Oh, wow. Okay. Yeah. Nice. Okay. Okay. But I was willing to pay for it. You can't take the battery. Huh? No. But I'm not too worried about it. Yeah, we're going to have to find a It's under the plan, they'll give me a new battery. Too, you know? So. Right now, I want to get them set up to I can get them, I can probably get a 14 smartphone for or I might be able to get one for $49 or $79. Okay. That's a monthly plan with it. I pay 150 a month for 10 gigs a month. Well, that's, that 40 is adding it to an existing plan. Right. The startup cost, I'm sitting here crunching numbers in my head. I'm looking at a startup cost from absolutely nothing to say this, probably a couple hundred dollars. Well, with my credit, with, with my credit, I always end up having to pay a deposit on the phone itself when I sign up for a plan, yeah. which comes back several months later, but still, you know what I mean? Right now, I've shot in the field as a camera. So, like, I'm into batteries. I'm yeah. sure I got 12 to 13 hours of battery. Yeah. Right. How much does that cost? The battery pack? Yeah. yeah. Like Her battery pack, pack is What's cheaper. She's around $150. I've got one that cost me $180. Yeah. Yep. Yours is how much? Mine was about $180. Mm-hmm. It's a different brand. It's also about 18 hours. But, but, but an 18-hour energizer cool. for $150 seems completely reasonable. And, and you, you can know, still get you one for... You know what you need to do is to get... Is to, is to Talk to the virtual down at WBI and say, look, let's get on the air. Well, I'll, I'll email you uh, and say, hey, you know, like, why don't we raise money for you guys to get a group? 
that, no, seriously, this is something very effective to do. The cops, I know, can't stand it. And it'd be useful to make sure the equipment is secure, nobody's fucking around with it. Right. But, you know, like, you know, so I'll you could send as many people. Come to our live stream channel. We don't put it out that much. We don't set people up for a lot of the other groups, but not for ourselves. Well, so I, we do have a media team fund, and we would take donations of equipment. Well, it's an idea that, what the hell. No, it, yeah. you know what, and because you can't help so many people. But there are people like us who already yeah. know what we're doing and just lack yeah. because of Well, that's the right. point. To make yeah. sure they've seen a couple things and they're, all, they're ready to go. Yeah. Right. We, we already know how to use the equipment. We know how to use the program. A couple thousand bucks would not be that difficult to raise. No, we could. Let me throw the ideas in. I got your email. Absolutely. Thank you, brother. Thank you very, very much. The VAI guy. Thank you very much. We've been helping you guys in all sorts of ways. Wait, I know. appreciate it. I've been listening to the VAI guy. No, no, no. There's other shit going on. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> right, thank you. Good to see you. Thank you. Oh, well, that was very nice. Thank you. Thank everybody for being here. Other visitors, Rick, Sean, When you have a better picture of more pixels or megapixels, does it stream slower? No. Does it, it doesn't slow it down. No, in, in general, as long as I have a good connection, it, right. it streams nice and smooth, beautiful picture. And that's the iPhone there? Yes. Okay. If I have a poor connection, it gets all choppy. Yeah. You know, and you'll you'll see that a lot um, on on various live stream, you streams. You'll see a choppy picture. Yeah. Generally, that means they're having trouble with their connection. Okay. Um, so that's not a megapixel thing. That's just no, 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 no. Uh, it, but you can. I personally can see the difference when I I'm watching, say, Tim was using an iPhone, yeah. and and our felt friend Stop Motion Solo, who isn't. His Tim's is crisp and yeah. clear next to. To solo, so it's. Uh, I think that's the bottom line. I could afford it, so I did it. You know, but frankly, at this point, we'd like to get anybody out there who can. <laughs> Have you looked at the Contour HD live streaming? The which? Contour. I don't know that one. No. It's it's, it's a bike. That's a bike. A camera that was built for live action, <laughs> biking, <laughs> surfing, whatever. But mm -hmm. they just made a live stream module. Oh really? It's 1080p. Uh, oh, you mean that new live stream gadget that you can buy? Uh, yes, yes. I, I heard about that. So when you get that camera, how do you get it? It's built in, like has a Wi-Fi? Well, the box, you're, you're, you're buying a... They don't have enough details here. My understanding is it's like a box you buy. That actually does the connection. It's not really. Okay. Their web page is not really. It's confusing as hell. <laughs> I mean, that's okay, a pretty so bulky box there, yeah. But the camera itself is, is about that big. Yeah. Hmm. You can pop it on one of these. Right. Yeah, yeah. Sure. yeah, it's a really. It's, it's a wide angle. And the thing is, what I love about it is it works in such low light. That, I, I'm blown away by how well this looks with works it, at night the only time I ever used the light I probably didn't have to but it was March 17th and I was shining it on the cops oh. as they busted people um, but I haven't here at night I don't need it it's amazingly how, how good this is and I'm, I'm sure that's similar in that regard I'm telling you I, <laughs> I, small sensor I can't shoot no, I understand. It, 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 it blew my mind how well this the camera in this sucker works. It's just a really like good camera. About the yeah, I don't I don't know about what he was saying. I, the, the battery in the phone it, it sucks dry quick. It's good like that, but with one of these suckers attached, well, let's see. I've been at fifty eight percent since I got here. This will give me about four hours additional. Oh right, and right. This is about fifty bucks. Um, and that'll give you four hours. In, in addition to what's built To your in. regular... I've used right. this for just GPS tracking, and this, this alone's lasted 12 hours. Damn, that's good. Yeah. But, but the screen's dark. Right, right. Yeah, this is the boost case. It also supposedly helps with the signal as well. Okay. And then it does away with the standard iPhone connector and uses just a micro USB. Uh -huh. So you don't have to deal with that. That's yeah. nice. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, Amazon, fifty bucks. That's a little rubbery case. Yeah, I got everything but the phone from Amazon, so. <laughs> well, I should say through Amazon. Yeah.
So iPhone, what network do you use? Sprint or? I'm on Verizon. Verizon. That's what we had to begin with, so yeah. that's what I got. Yeah. You know? Do you have unlimited <coughs> data plans? They no longer have an unlimited oh, data plan. It it's that? costing me through the nose because I have to go for 10 gigabytes to have enough to go through a month, and that's just doing once once a week. And what is that? And, and that's costing me like another hundred and fifty dollars a month. And now I can afford like it right now. I can afford it right now, but it hurts. Let me so tell I, you. I have a, I have a, a two gig basic plan, and that's something that hurts. So. I know it's insane. And I had to spend the hundred and fifty to get the ten. <laughs> T-Mobile has unlimited data. I don't know if they still offer it. I don't know. But there's no iPhone. Uh, yeah, T-Mobile, T-Mobile and Boost has it now. A lot of the, the there's one for like no contract people that don't want to have contracts, so you have the unlimited data. But I don't know what their networks are like. Or if they probably use one of the big three networks. So yeah. Yeah, I, yeah, I really mean, don't the ideal know. thing is to try to tap into some Wi-Fi. Yeah. Around. Oh yeah, that's what I'm doing right now. <laughs> yeah, oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. So you don't have to worry about your data. This thing automatically will grab whatever Wi-Fi. Oh yeah, it still counts. Yeah, you can tell it. Uh, it still counts. But yeah, actually, I tell this thing to go for um, um, the Optimum Online because I already have Optimum Online. Right. So it automatically searches for Optimum Online Wi-Fi okay. for me. But it doesn't always find it. Yeah. In fact, when I started up at Bryant Park today. Um, I couldn't find any damn thing at first, and then I finally found the uh, New York Public Library, and it said, "Sure, you can stream." Saturdays and Sundays, you can use. Yes, oh, so I do that on a Tuesday. I get a huge list. Really? Forget it. Yeah, I believe it. Week, it's so packed. Yeah, everyone's, everyone's using, using the network. network. Yeah. You can't yeah, right now I, I can come up with this humongous list. No, a lot of them are locked, but still, yeah. you know, this huge list will come up. So I wasn't too worried about it. What's, what's a real drag is you're doing a march and everything's fine. You glance up and you realize that it's gone. <laughs> and and you got to stop and go through all the bullshit. That's, but. that's what Liberty was like. It, was, it got so hard to even just upload a still image from the iPhone. Right, right. I, mean, I heard it, about it, that. Eight tries and then why don't you just walk a block away and you could get it better. So. But then more and more people started bringing their own. Yeah, there was so much traffic and then... You know, people owe their jam. I think it's jamming. I just think everyone... No, I don't think it was jamming. I think all too often people say jamming just because somebody's having a bad connection, you know. It's, I don't think they're going to bother. No, that was, they were saying that in front of Federal Hall now. Yeah, 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 I've heard that. Just what you need is to have these Wall Street bankers not no, no. able to use their cell phones. Yeah, right? That was... Now, the way I understood it, the first time they raided Zuccotti, they actually shut down the cell towers for a couple hours. That would make sense. They shut down the cell towers for a couple hours so that we couldn't get people in. They shut down the, the local train stops so we couldn't get people in. And that's so that nobody could call out and let them know, hey, we're being raided. Yeah. Well, the last Typical. time, last time <laughs> they were trying, when they were doing the raid for the cleaning. Right. Yeah. yeah. I mean, those calls were going out. The police were going out. That's Come right. Down now. Everyone got down. Yeah, there. yeah, I yeah. Like 4 a.m. You know. I hear you. <laughs> yeah, I called in. So I work full time. I was like, oh, 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 oh sorry, I got a stomach ache. Can't make it. Oh, my son is so happy I'm an occupier. He's getting Tuesday off. <laughs> from school, <laughs> but I'm dragging his tush down here. <laughs> he said, "All right, you want you want a day off? You're coming with me." That's right. He can bring his iPod and take pictures. <laughs> you know, no problem. How does he take the movement overall? He's he's just learning about it and 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 realizing that the world isn't as simple as he thought it was. And um, while there's still a lot of kids left that doesn't really care that much, he's beginning to realize that. He's not going to be a kid that much longer, and, and there's a lot of real stuff going on. He hasn't witnessed anything serious yet, but I brought him out here two weeks ago, just to give him a feel of what it's like to come out with me and then stream with me, and hopefully it won't get too crazy on May Day, but if it does, I think we're ready. May Day you know, be I explained to him in great detail what would happen in the worst scenario. And that would be if we both got arrested. And, and I explained to him that there's nothing fun about it. I went into great detail, let's put it that way. And he's decided he's willing to, he's willing, no, I haven't. But I'm, 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 I don't intend to get arrested. If I do, I do. But I have no intention of it. But I wanted him to be ready for it. Because if it were to happen somehow, for all I know, we could have got separated. There's, you know, and he's a long-haired kid. 
you know? Uh, yeah. So, you know, I wanted him to realize that, you know, this could turn very badly, you know? And he still thinks that he's willing to take a chance. So I said, okay, we're going to come down and do it, and we're going to see it for real. <laughs> I, I just learned scaffolding is just watch your back. <laughs> that's what the cops love to they use that as an oh you know, no, yes 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 uh, I've noticed no, it was I've noticed big Times Square march way back uh, right right and we they we marched up from Washington Square and they sent us to 40 46 and it was a zoo it was just way too many people and they realized alright we screwed up they start sending people back not everyone was believing them that we would be allowed back in. Right, right. So they weren't going as quickly as the police like. And we got near the corner, and we're in the middle of the scaffolding. And I'm reporting the whole thing. And all of a sudden, a hand cuts in front of me, draw a line, white shirt. And blue guys just come right in. Hmm. Everyone on the other side was arrested. I went home. Wow. wow. <laughs> and, I mean, it was literally like this. I hear you, I hear you, I understand. And then you start feeling, get out of here. And I was shocked. <laughs> you get home and you realize, I have black and blue marks. Like I did. <laughs> you don't even know when uh, I was fortunate. I have to say that the cops didn't give me a second look except to say, media, move. Yeah. That's why I have this. I was, I was not, I was not, I had the Guy Fawkes mask on my back. Yep, yep, yep. I had all my buttons. Yep. So I was a participant as well as recording. I just foolishly got a haircut. Now I look like a cop. <laughs> <laughs> well, I used to have a haircut. Yeah. My wife talked me into getting a haircut. Your hair is terrible. You need to start it over again. You guys do, do more than just live streaming? Um, yeah, well, mostly what we do is, is cap other live streams because... We can only get out really during the weekend. Libby managed to get out a little more often than I do, but I have a lot of responsibilities, unfortunately, and I get out when I can. And uh, so. Not, I don't live stream, but mm -hmm. I shoot a lot of video. I shoot a lot of stills. I'm, I work a block away from Wall Street so on their lunch. There you go, day. yeah. <laughs> from 5 till 7, 8. Mm -hmm. So I've been there for some real interesting times in the Freedom Cage. And I, you know, I would like to share and help you. Sure, we're always, uh, I'm always, we have, you know, we have a video loop that we run when there's nothing to show. <laughs> we also, uh, I have a website, uh, occearth.com. I have so much stuff on my YouTube channel from... Uh, oh, cool. Day five. What's your YouTube channel? J-E-N-N-Y-C-2-6-3. I, I, I'm just about to break 100 videos total. I don't do a lot, but it's more quality than quantity. That's right. There you go. And they're all full. I mean, most are 720, but they're all HD. Cool, cool. NYC 2638. And if you're on Facebook? Yeah. So if you want Jen, Jennifer, Julia, Maskell, M A S K B L L, I've got. I don't know how many thousands of pictures of me there. Let me ask you, E L L. You can get in touch with me through any of those uh, emails. Well, with any other occupiers, we'll pop up as yeah. mutual. Yeah, I'm sure. What's your name, sir? Sean. Sean. Yeah. Jennifer. Jennifer. Kevin. Kevin. I'm known as Mac online, Mac Dale. Oh, okay. So. <laughs> All right, cool. So yeah, I don't have a sock pocket anymore. I use my real. It's like, you know, I have a driver's license. Oh, I'm out there. Yeah. So the police know who I am. Everybody knows who I am. I'm not worried about it. Yeah. It's just that now they know me as Mac online. So, yeah. you know, just, it's been since September. So everybody calls me Mac. I worry more about work. So I don't let anyone at work see me. I don't understand and that. That's a, I mean, it's, I work for a Wall Street law firm. <laughs> That's and cool, I'm brother. IT, so it's worse I'm fortunate I work for myself. So everything, so the, I keep it totally. I don't go to our AWS pages at work. Right. Right. I, I understand. <laughs> the last thing I need is the CIO saying, "What are you talking about?" <laughs> they would not be a kid. And no, Understood. That's what it is. I don't. You know, my beliefs, are my beliefs, there. And we'll teach them at some point. <laughs>
We can only hope and try. That's, I mean, you That's know, look, here. it's a law firm, and they don't do, you know, people have given law firms dead rounds. Our firm is not one of those. Oh, that's nice. They will not, they, it's a 150-year-old law firm. They don't want anything to tarnish their image. Uh -huh. So if a client comes in and says, hey, we want you to help us break the law, they're like, you want that firm up the block. Ah. <laughs> you know, we will help you work within the law, and that's it. Well, you got to appreciate that. It is. It is very regular. Now, if we could just get the cops to work within the law. <laughs> Sorry, I can't help it. <laughs> no, but it's true. Oh, man. They don't even know. I get confused law. when the law changes every day. I don't know that one. It's my favorite. Uh, it's just, it's. They, they make it up on the spot to match what they want not to happen. Someone just told me something the other day. It's crazy. God, I can't remember. Somebody, somebody here. Are you serious? You just made that up. That's not a law. That is not a law. But we've had. Oh, I, I saw that online. <laughs> I remember that. Somebody went, What are you crazy? Yeah, I know. I remember that. Yeah. I remember. It was when it was raining. And the cops wouldn't let them on the side. All of a sudden, you know, you say, uh, you, we have to be on the sidewalk. But that's the sidewalk. Not now it isn't. Oh, here, yeah. 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 That was that one. I can't believe that the one. The day is right. that, that um, that other march against police brutality got back here. Yeah. And they were doing that. Get on the sidewalk. This is a sidewalk. No, that part's the sidewalk. Wait a minute. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Stop it already. Incredible. <laughs> You got my contact, man. Don't worry about it. Yeah, that footage. And Send it on. We'll, we'll put it out. Rob, he's the older guy with graffiti all over yeah. his shirt. Mm -hmm. They, um, Murray grabbed his arm and just almost broke it, throwing him into me. And he just <laughs> right into the camera. Nice. But Bob is usually, oh, I'm so sorry. And he's like, you fucking schmuck. This is America. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he's a that guy's funny. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 this is New York. <laughs> Joke that they all talk like this. It was, hey, 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 hey. Dude, dude. Shit is real. Here, here is a New York echo. A New York echo goes, hello, shut the fuck up. Okay? When I ran into somebody, I turned around and apologized. I know. I like, I accidentally ran into somebody. No, they. You have to say what are you stupid? You make you made eye contact. Don't do that. We were walking across the street. This guy just decided he was going to run her over. He gets on the horn. I'm like waddling across the crosswalk. We have the crosswalk light. You know. Yeah, we're not even doing the New York cross. You know. Going and this guy tries to turn and starts honking at me like, go back. She just snapped. Hey, I'm walking in. <laughs> I about fell out loud. <laughs> 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 he goes, oh, you're learning. You're getting right there. If you go to Chicago, never ask for ketchup on a hot dog. Don't worry, I won't, but. <laughs> you will have four guys walk away from a hamburger. Nope. Yeah, I, I don't understand the mustard on the hamburger thing. That's new. Okay. But when McDonald's started putting goddamn mustard on my hamburgers, I got pissed off. <laughs> it's a southern thing. I discovered. 
Indian restaurants in Queens. Oh, jeez, here we go. Oh. Right on. Look at the other one. The other one's so super cute. Queens plate thing, I think. I think we should like tie-dye it. <laughs> there you go, folks. You can't beat that. Beautiful. You want to bring it to draw attention? One thing. On the belly. No, I think it's a balloon. No, the parents for OWS kind of used to be the women. I'm the madman wizard, eh? Well, I'm the madman anyway. So I kind of feel like a five year old. Did you add your own little thing to say? I did, because I don't think it should just say don't OWS. Don't taste me, bro. Don't taste me, bro. Police brutality plus legacy. Well, it's like when you write dead babies. You want me to write dead babies? It's like, no. That's too bad. Nobody likes dead babies. No, no, no. It's a bit radical. Why need to pick a fetal injury? Well, Let's avoid that, Virginia, too. Virginia, or a couple other states, is now murdered. What state was that? Uh, uh, Vermont, Virginia, some, some red states. The one which no, was, it was it, it, two weeks prior to... No, they passed the law just recently. Just, recent, that, just like this past week. No, 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 they were saying, right, but you could... What is it? It's desirable to use two weeks prior to actual pregnancy. <laughs> because that's when the woman ovulates. Uh huh. They uh -huh. Yeah. It's yeah, freaking so it's insane. Point. If she miscarries, uh, like, oh, by the way, it happens to be natural. Yeah. Sure. Yeah. Well, I like the counter bill that failed, where every sperm you kill yes. go, is, is murdered. So is illegal? That's yes. it. No that's it. That's it. You're done. Oh, she's the same senator who brought forth, if you want Viagra, you have to have a colonoscopy. Yeah, she, she, right, right, right. Right. Oh, God. The scope thing there was Nice talking to you. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it was good meeting you. We'll hear from you, I yes, hope. Absolutely. Good, excellent, man. Okay, cool. Take care, brother. That's cool. He's got lots of footage we can use. That's fine by me, yeah. That's very neat. Our first action here in, well, I guess I was on First action, though. Yeah, we were aggressive right. camping by sitting in the vehicles at the, while they were talking to our body. On this march. The window's were open this far, and she's walking up like, have a good one. On this, this march, I was just saying, there's two little girls. They, they, they come run to mom, mom gives them a pamphlet. They run up to somebody, here! Oh, that's Are you perfect. not going to take it from right? this little kid? Right. Yeah. <laughs> you have to take it. You, you have to take it. That's yeah. right. <laughs> Yeah, that works too, yeah. But there's nothing like a little kid. Hey, you guys heard of the Free Staters? <laughs> okay, it rings a bell. They're against their politics. They're like super libertarian. Oh. I saw a video of them the other day, and they're really good at, like, knowing the law of cops and de arresting okay, I just want to get an interview. Like, these guys go around with video cameras and, and they'll go in, like, a carry stick with a strap, with a gun. Oh, All right? They're illegal. They'll walk up to a cop right here. We'll be back. You'll see us All right. And they'll walk right up to the cop and be like, and the cop's like, what are you doing? Oh, what's your arm? And he's like, yeah. And the cop's like, let me see your ID. And she says, no. Am I under arrest? Like, they have all yeah. the lingo down. Yeah. They do it respectfully, yeah. but very directly. And they, these cops, like, hop in the car and leave because they're afraid. It's crazy. I'm like, I wish we could yeah, get some I, strategy involved. Without here, the know? guns, yeah. Yeah, well, without the guns. That's course. the hard like part. Like, knowing the law. Yeah, 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 yeah. The trouble is, the trouble is, though, that... I've been watching, okay? I've been watching New York all along now. And you can you can tell that to a cop. And it's useless. It doesn't make any difference. Because if nothing else, you don't have a gun on your hip. Okay? So, when they were filming, they did do some work in Jersey. Uh -huh. And they had the most... They never came to New York. Right. They had the most trouble with Jersey. No doubt. No Jersey doubt. Like, yeah, I don't give a shit. That they right don't. Here. That's right. And they had to threaten, like, you know, we're going to... Um, internal affairs or some shit the guy kind of like backed down but yeah yeah no I'm telling you it's just <laughs> New York cops did New York cops say you know you got a gun boy you're going down yeah, oh yeah. <laughs> oh yeah.
And then they'll ask questions. If you have a gun, a hairbrush, a lighter, anything, you yeah. like get like 100 shots. Uh-huh. That's it. They're not interested. Like uh, later on, they might ask a question, but... <laughs> yeah, if anybody finds out, right? they might... See, it's 5 o'clock. It's still a beautiful day. Like I said, it's been nice. Yeah, I figure I might even give in and go home around 8 o'clock. <laughs> I don't know. I'm gonna see. I'm going to see what, what's happening. I have to get out of here by before midnight. <laughs> or I have to pay to pay, pay to park more. <laughs> well, I, I live in North Jersey. Okay. I got this this neat little application which tells me where all the the parking is, the parking garages, and how much they cost. Wow. And some of them I get a coupon. I, I just press the button and it comes up with the number. I show them the number and they say, oh, okay, twelve bucks for the day. Now, I couldn't find one for twelve, but I found a fifteen dollar one which is just down and around the corner. So Fifteen bucks. Fifteen bucks. Next yeah, as long as I'm out before midnight. Okay. So now that I've got that application, I don't have a problem with parking. <laughs> My biggest problem was I had to park here, and then I had, I, I was late, so I took the cab up to Bryant Park. Yeah. If I'd known I wasn't late, I would have took the damn train. I knew how to do it, so I figured it out. Right. F train. I take the F train, and it'll take me to the right station. There, right. I knew exactly right. what to yeah. do. <laughs> I was afraid I'd be late, and then of course they didn't take off for an hour and a half. You know, I got there. I know, I know. That's right. I went to the wrong spot. I was out in front of the library, the public yeah. library. There was nobody there, but this cop walked by with a megaphone, and somebody asked him. He said, uh, "Oh yeah, yeah, it's one twelve thirty. Okay, I'm too early." But I ended up having to walk over to the other end of the park to find anybody. It was a good thing I did. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, there weren't many people. I sat there for a while before anybody showed up, and there weren't that many people there. No, I, they did not really advertise the march part yeah. very well at all. Yeah, it was funny. what I saw. It was it was like lost in the middle of a paragraph about this event. Yeah. Did you uh, see it on the Facebook page? No, no. Okay. I, I was I went to NYCGA. Yeah. I use that for my events. You know, to keep track of events for the most part. I always forget to look on Facebook. <laughs> well, it looks like the party's really going high now. Yeah, the party getting started. Is Lauren, her hair is bluer than ever. I assume that's her. Yeah, of <laughs> I'm learning names <laughs> bit by bit as I go. <laughs> this girl, I've seen out here a lot with the uh, hula hoops. She's really good, man. I couldn't hula hoop if I wanted to. <laughs> Wall on my <laughs> uh, I wonder what happened to Lippy. I don't know. She wandered off. Uh, I'm sure she's okay. But see, this is this is where we talk about looking after each other. Yeah. We lose each other constantly. So <laughs> it's easy to do around. Oh, I know, I know. Well, that's why she's got her her, her niece. Her niece will stick with her. Yeah. Next week or no, on Tuesday, my son will be here to stick with me. I think Rob's going to be with me too. So that's I'll, great. I'll have some back. Yeah, 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 yeah. And that'll keep me from doing anything stupid. Yeah. <laughs> you yeah, should have heard me the day I watched the arrest, boy. <laughs> I was telling you, I was in I just get so angry because I watched that stuff. And I'm sure that, you know, they would have been more than happy to take me away. But, but you know, with my son along, I think I might bite my tongue a little, yeah. you know? Yeah. So. I got arrested on the Brooklyn Bridge. And then, um, like, two or three spring trainings ago, I got hit by a scooter cop. And I just got really mad. I turned around, and I am like this. And then some big boy rage cop just grabbed yeah, yeah, yeah. me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You raised your hands. Yeah, and I was just yeah. so yeah. mad. Yeah. It's hard to keep it through. No, I understand completely. It was all I could do not to, you know. <laughs> well, not really, but. <laughs> can you imagine, like, one little baby on like. Oh, I'd be dead me. And that'd be the last time the monopod got around. Yeah, then they would probably use that as an excuse. Yeah, I, don't, I wouldn't want to give them an excuse right. like that. In fact, uh, my, my wife said, they let you have that? <laughs> yeah, it's a photo, photograph equipment, you know? Right. She said, they don't think that's a club? No, they don't think it's a club. <laughs> Believe me, once it gets dark and I go home, on my walk to my car, this is a it club. Is a club. <laughs> Magically transformed. That's right. <laughs> Shoot, the, well, on the 17th when I was here and I was so late, I was up until like 1.30 I was here filming the cops and there was these two guys very strange came up and started asking me weird questions and stuff right. and later on the people on my chat channel were saying oh you know you could have gotten mugged I said you guys got to remember I'm always armed 
you know? I, I had a club in my hands. Like, you know, besides, we were standing in front of all the police. <laughs> Unless they were cops, what were they going to do? And if yeah. they were cops, they were wasting their time anyway. About the police and civilians in this <laughs> <laughs> Yes, Netmom, I am having fun. Thank you very much. Hey, Netmom. Yay, Netmom. Rick says hi. Yes, he does. General Bear says. Uh, five hour drive. Well, that's because that's because General Bear is in oh. Albany. Oh yeah. Is he coming down? Uh, I don't think so. They actually have actions happening in Albany. Good. Originally, Lippy was going to go, but she's become involved in some radio interviews that are going to take place. Right on. So she's going to be here together. We'll, we'll be streaming together, and she'll be doing radio interviews. And she will. She promises she will see General Bear at Albany at some point, hopefully in the near future. <coughs> but there she is, I see her, wandering around. I'm not sure she's seen me yet. <laughs> and now she's saw me. Okay. Right. Hello. How does you guys are talking? Is it, what, did you text it? Or what? No, no, we're talking. And there's generally what we have on the channel is both of our video. And then they'll turn one of the sound up so that everybody can hear it. I got you. But they, our, our mods are in the channels and can hear both of us. I got you. Cool. And so whoever whoever is doing the more interesting thing, I suppose, I can choose. And uh, we keep running into each other and crossing the streams. What are they doing? Party down there? Yeah, they're having a good time. There is a sign. Oh, you have to go see it. And they wrote stuff on it, <laughs> and it's really great. I gotta check it out. The woman's place is in the revolution. Oh, okay. Climber for NLG. So they're up doing it at three o'clock in the morning. It's really awesome. <laughs> um, we will have to check it really out. There's really nice guy that's got the cute puppy, and I've always let him know. I mean, he has other people, but I've told him that like, if anything ever happens, he'll just hand his puppy off to someone. Hand his puppy. Hand his puppy. He'll get his puppy back. His puppy will be taken care of. Cool. You know, so, I love that dog is so chill. Cool, cool, cool. Can you see my niece? Can you tell her that her mother's freaking out? If 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 I if I see her, she's, I have, her, she's here with a friend, so I think they probably walk oh, together. Oh, I she see. Up, so you know, which is fine. Yeah. They're, together. They're fine. Her mother just worries. I did, I did kind of lose track of her there after the. Uh, well, like, that's when he showed up. So. Class. Oh, that explains it. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> well, then right, then she can be here. Okay, Brick, have fun. All right. See you later. We'll see you um, later Tuesday. Okay. He'll be back. I will be here. I'm gonna have to take a break soon. We'll be here for a little while. Uh, this event is technically supposed to end at 8 o'clock. There's no way I can make it. I don't know. Let's see. It's 5 o'clock. I can make another three hours, but see what happens. Yeah. I don't know if anything else. There was something else planned. For here? Yeah. Okay. I don't know. I know that uh, there was a women's march thing that happened earlier. Might have been more interesting than the march we were in, but that's another matter. Uh, it was small. It was tiny. <coughs> and I'm convinced it's because it wasn't advertised properly. And even in the event announcement, it, the march part was buried in the text. Yeah, and, it and, was. And so I'm really not surprised in retrospect. I was a little disappointed. <laughs> after, well, you got your exercise. I, I, I got my exercise. I needed that after sitting my, on my ass on a ship. <laughs> Bobbing around on the ocean, but that was fun. Oh uh, yeah, I'm gonna have. I'm trying to think if there's any place besides Whole Foods that I might go to. And I actually, so they don't have the good food vendor there. The guy that makes the chicken and rice. Oh, I don't know who it is. That's just separate. Yeah, I don't want to. I don't know. Oh, I see him over there. And there's a Starbucks, but the Starbucks don't have that. My oh, okay, wait, wait. This is my souvenir from... Souvenir from the cruise? From Bermuda. What is that, a chip? Oh, that's sweet. That's one dollar. That's a dollar in Bermuda. In Bermuda money. See, they got a boat on the other okay. side. Yeah, I've never been to Bermuda, and I've been to the Caribbean, like, a lot. Well, they did the change thing. Well, it's not really the Caribbean. They they, they say I so. Know, Bear, thank you. I send love to Albany. Yes. Right, and I and I was I was informing them that, that you were planning on making it at some point. I am. Um, um, it's now it's, it's 
Yeah, I, I picked up this coin when the guy handed it to me, and then with a bunch of quarters. And I looked at it, and at first I'm wondering what happened to our founding fathers. You know, that just wasn't like anybody I knew. And then it turned out to be Queen Elizabeth. So yeah. anyway, but I thought I was in need. I used to be a coin collector. So. <laughs> Oh, it's nothing like a ship. There's nothing like a ship. You'll never sleep as well as on a rocking ship. Oh, I ship, know. Let me tell you. Except if it's really rocking. Well. In which case you get bonine chewable. See, I don't. Or twice a day, I recommend. I don't get movement. Oh yes, I do. I bet. Problems very much. The only time I ever got seasick, the boat was going up and down six feet yeah. within seconds. I mean, we were in a chop, and yeah, we yeah. went. It was a small boat, and I got sick. But on that big sucker, even though we had a force 10 gale and it was rocking and rolling to me, New York Harbor, you get a lot of it was nothing. It was nothing to me. It was like, this is my kind of roller coaster. Yeah. So I can't fall off. <laughs> I, get, I get sick, but I, I know how to take care of it so I can enjoy it. Well, that's I don't good, avoid anyway. it. I I take the right yeah, a, My wife has a bit of a problem with it, but she had more trouble on the bus ride we took yeah, than she did on the boat. <laughs> oh, the, the roads are crazy, man. Up and down and around. Oh, man. It's cool there. It was really nice. It was chilly there for us. But, so we got there like maybe two weeks before it got warm enough. Yeah, that's probably really going to time it just right. And then it gets real expensive. But not being a big beach person, I wasn't too worried about it, though. I love that water, that blue, blue water. But the wind, oh, I got a shot. You got to look at my... Oh, that one shot of the ocean yes. is just so blue, it and kills. Um, yes, you almost killed me. I don't believe it. I almost wrote, you are killing me. Yeah, I'm dying right now. I don't, I, I never believed that there was such a thing. There is. I used to think that, that the Atlantic Ocean was gray. No. And that it could not possibly be any other color. Hi, Angry Passages. <laughs> How are you? Oh, is he there? Oh, hello. Hello. Up. Hooray. Angry Passages, you missed my teaching. We're very glad to, to know yeah, he's about. I lost my knee. And I have to, I'm whining. Now yeah. I'm whining. We're whining. We're whining. We've been here too long. We're getting We're bored tired. and tired. What are you tired of? <laughs> <laughs> Standing around talking to each other at the moment. <laughs> oh, and he's got a This is Breakfast of Champions. Ramen noodles. Ramen noodles. That'll work. I brought them myself. Here, you need one of these. <laughs> Thank you. You're welcome. This is the guy we were talking to before earlier. He's from Pittsburgh. Pittsburgh. Great. Talking about Pittsburgh, he's got lots to say. He's got occupiers in his house too. <laughs> My house called Occupy Merlin. We put the live stream off the Occupy channel. John Carpenter, which is one of our live streamers down Excellent. in Pittsburgh, uh, lives in my house. And we, we have a comedy hour whenever we're bored. We do an Occupy Merlin on, on the live stream. Well, excellent. We'll have to keep an eye out for that. <laughs> and usually that's livestream.com, Occupy Pittsburgh, and then top it. Okay. That'll come up in my search. <laughs> uh, we've done one around St. Patty's Day we did. Cool, cool. And don't know when the next one. It's whenever everybody's fucking... I understand. <laughs> I understand completely. <laughs> the craziness of Merlin. I hear you, brother. <laughs> we need craziness. Of the right kind, anyway. <laughs> Hi, Angry. We need one more. We need one million times ten in here. Yes, agreed. By Monday. It sure would be nice, at least by Tuesday. If we could get them here Monday night, we could close down this a billion people. They wouldn't know how to handle it. No, absolutely not. <laughs> absolutely not. I agree with you 100%. I would be glad not to be able to get into New York that day. <laughs> oh, you'd have to be here to walk. Well, I would certainly try. <laughs> no, I see what you're saying. That's true. That's true. Be an occupier for a day. Yeah, right. What are they going to do when a billion people are here? They ain't got no bu that many buses. I'd like to see several thousand at least start. I mean, uh, I'd, be, I'd begin to worry, but I know it's going to get warm, and the people are going to come flying out of the cracks. I'm not too worried in the long run. I was hoping for more today, but You're that's not all right. asking for a million. I'm asking for a billion. No, I know. <laughs> Believe me, I just assumed your billion came through. <laughs> and, and could you imagine a billion people on a mark? We would level, we'd level the city. Yeah, I don't think they'd be lucky to be able to march. <laughs> That's a crowd. 
<laughs> we would walk all over the place. Absolutely. If they'd get in the way. Oh, they wouldn't even come out. <laughs> that one billion angry citizens. No, no, no. I hear you. I hear you. I understand. They would. They would be bringing up the tank. <laughs> Absolutely. It's not running away. <laughs> uh. See, I don't think it's small. No, I, I understand that. I, I can see that. And that's good. <laughs> They I'll wouldn't know how to. If, they, if there was a billion people arrived in here in, in a day, they would not be able to. They would not mentally be able to cope. Oh, I agree. I'd be, they'd be lucky to be able to even get them into the city. They would lay down their <laughs> arms for us. Yep. And say, "We surrender." That's correct. You know, that's bigger than the seventh largest largest army. <laughs> Considerably bigger. <laughs> A billion nonviolent protesters? Yeah. Oh, I hear you. I'm with you. <laughs> they just say, is it that bad? It might start them thinking. <laughs> Are we wrong? Bankers would lock their doors. Oh, yeah. <laughs> As it is, you really want to make money right now? Go into security. <laughs> Bankers are buying security shit like crazy. <laughs> Screw that. Oh, I agree. <laughs> Screw anyone who wants to sell themselves to the bankers. I'm joking. Just, I'm so, not. just so you know, I was joking. And I'm not. <laughs> I hear you. I agree. And and if people, if they don't like what I'm saying, screw the bankers. Make them spend their billions. I'm with you. I'm with you. Because if they don't have a, ba a billion to spend, <laughs> they will close. They won't know what to do. Because <laughs> the people, we the people will not bail them out again. That's right. I, no, our, no, we're through with that shit. <laughs> if our, if our congressmen even think they're going to a vote, well, there has to be an emergency legislation that says that we the people of the United States, as our forefathers did. Okay. What did they tell England? <laughs> In no uncertain terms. <laughs> They told England, England thought they could put us in check. Our forefathers said, give us liberty or give us death. That's right. Well, they all, our politicians will then have the choice. Give us our liberty or give us our death. Yeah. Because it won't be their country anymore. Bottom line is, we outnumber them, damn it. I'm with you. All them state politicians. All them federal politicians with a billion people in a protest, they would have to take notes. Absolutely, absolutely. A, a few hundred thousand ain't going to get their attention. No, a billion people close close this city instantly. <laughs> they wouldn't be able to move for us. <laughs> Pardon me. Angry, you don't know how upset we were when we found out you got arrested. I almost got in the car right then to come on down, but I... Wife talked me out of it. But we are so glad to know that you are back out with the rest of us crazy people. Thank you for being you. Hey, hey! There we go.
What is live stream? Um, it is a way to live stream ah. to the to the uh, web. So I have a channel, a website online, <clears throat> on which you can watch what I'm showing right now. Can I snap a picture of the address on things? Certainly. Actually, would you like a card? I have a card. <laughs> There you go, Beautiful. sir. Wow. That's me personally. We have a team. We have another streamer out here today. Mostly we stream on weekends because, you know, we're working folks. So what are you trying to, uh, what are you trying to capture? Uh, we're trying to capture exactly what's happening to show everybody the truth because so often the mainstream media twists what's happening and make it look bad somehow. But the problem these days is that all media... Is twisted. Ah. I mean, even every all media. But I am media. Exactly. And I'm not twisted. No, the reason we're all twisted is the world is bigger than we're able to see it right now. I mean, we. And that's why we need. And that's why we need more and more people with one of these out here showing us what's going on. What is that one, by the way? This one happens to be an iPhone. Oh my God. That's well, an iPhone. Wow. Oh, and it, it can be done with... Uh, you can stream off for that. Yes, absolutely. I am right now, live. Uh, you, just, you just load onto that and stream... Uh, I, I have an application. Is it an iStream application? It's actually an it's called a Ustream, Ustream in this particular case. You meaning you. The yeah, the letter U. U. Um, and in this particular case, I'm using a Ustream channel. <coughs> you can use live stream as well. Um, there's even uh, another one called Bambooser, which is mostly European, but Americans use it as well. How much does it cost to like, get, get a hold of you screen? Well, it, to, to do it full blast costs quite a bit. Of course. Of course, because they want, they, want, they want to treat you like a real TV right. station. Yes. But to do it on the level, we're, I'll, I'll, I'll tell you real quick the way we're doing it. Livestream was giving away free premium channels to occupiers who have more than 30 people write them and let them know. So we got that free channel. Unfortunately, they no longer make the application for an iPhone. So I'm streaming to Ustream, and, and my Livestream channel is capturing that and showing it on Livestream. But that wouldn't be available to everybody. Yes, the live the live stream is available to everyone. No, no, but I could get a I could become well, oh certainly no, yes no, you could only if you're occupied. What, what if well, you, that was for the free. Yeah. What, what if I'm What if I, I've got a seminar that I want to like be able to stream? Yeah, the odds are certainly in, in a small case you're not going to run into a big problem. The odds are you would know anything. So it would still be Ustream that I would use? Or? Ustream is, is the easiest to use because you can get an application that will definitely work on the newest smartphone. Right. If you have an older smartphone, you might be able to use the older application and for a live stream. But that's that's hard to find right now. Um, I don't know what that is. <laughs> but it, it, it requires a smartphone sure. and um, the iPhone happens to have the best picture, but the Android works Which well as well. Nice I bought this. I bought everything you see except for the phone uh, through Amazon. Um, it cost me a bit to set up like this. Not everybody goes so far as I do. A lot of people just simply use the phone and hold it. I'm shaky. So I, ho I have this unit to help steady it all. You need 3G or 4G, yes. Uh, you, would, you wouldn't want to do this on 2G. I know somebody who does, but they have a lot of trouble keeping a connection. And how, much, how much do you pay for 3G? It costs, it costs. I have Verizon and I pay an extra 150 a month to get the data plan a 10 gigabyte data plan, which if I didn't have, I'd run out before the end of the month. And I'm only doing it on weekends. So I can imagine for some of these regular everyday live streamers, it, it's very difficult. And that's why they're looking to, to raise money like they are. I'm actually paying for it myself right now. We hope in future to be able to raise money for the entire team. But right now, I'm not worried about that. I got the stuff I need to come out and do it. What if you just want to archive? Again, um, you can do well to simply archive. You can simply archive to uh, YouTube. Um, you do your film and you can upload that to YouTube. That won't cost you a cent. And you could run the, an hour or whatever. Or yeah, there? sure. I mean, on, on UStream, it, it records automatically while I'm streaming to UStream. And then what I do, because I tend to make them too big. <laughs> is I take them and I download them to my computer and then upload them to YouTube. If I make them little ones, 
like 10, 15 minutes long a piece, then I could do, do it directly to YouTube from Ustream. By the way, are you a, uh, a TV producer at all? Uh, only for that channel. I produce for that channel uh, when I'm not which, live streaming. Which, which, Occupy which Earth. Channel? Occupy Earth on live stream. I, I think you could be considered a, a TV producer given that you're doing that. And, 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 yeah. Do you, know, do, you, do you know the name uh, Harold Channel? No, not offhand, no. You've heard of Manhattan Cake? Absolutely. Harold is the longest running uh, video interviewer in the history of okay. television. Okay, cool. He's, he's interviewed Timothy Leary, Bucky Fuller, Gaddafi. Uh, right, right, right. Um, about once a month or once every two months, we have a meeting of the uh, producers. Mm -hmm. And maybe I'll invite you to um, those meetings. Well, I'd be curious, certainly. Yeah, yeah. I mean, he has, you know, people come speak or whatever mm -hmm. and so on. And, and he screams from there and so on. Well, that, yeah. that, that sounds very interesting, I must say. Yeah. Uh, well, you have my contact information. Yeah. So that and your name is? My Kevin. name is Kevin Dale. Yeah. Um, they know me online as Mac Dale, but uh, Kevin Dale is who I am, and then you can get in touch with me at any of these addresses. Great, <coughs> and uh, I'd be I'd be very happy to hear from you. Actually, let me see let me see what I got here. Yeah, the one with Kay Dale that goes directly to me. Okay. Okay. Nice meeting you, sir. You too, sir. Thank you. Thank you. Isn't that interesting? I might fit in with other producers were on real TV. Wouldn't that be fascinating? <laughs> yes, well... Oh, no problem. No, I'm not going to dance. That's the answer to question number one. The Hugs t-shirt is too small. I can see right away, although I'm in favor of it. Yes, I, I gave him a card. Thank you, Ruby. And, and angry, angry. We we're just sorry it had to be you. Uh, I know what you're saying, but we're sorry it had to be you. It certainly stirred us up when, when it was you. I have to say that. Oh, here's the sign that Libby was telling me about. We must take a picture of this. I don't know if anything, if you can actually read any of that. It says things like, a woman's place is in the revolution. My first general strike. Oh, May 1st general strike. <laughs> what happens at 3 in the morning when you're stoned? Indeed, indeed. <laughs> Though I don't remember that, that exactly, but... <laughs> we made this last night at like 3 in the morning. That's a beautiful piece of work. Right? <laughs> a woman's place is in the revolution. I was just not on that post. Agreed, agreed. Thank you. You're welcome. Us know. <laughs> Thank you for your work, sir. <laughs> that was great. Is that a camera? Yes, it is. Actually, it's an iPhone. Oh. But it's the same thing. It's a camera. Wow. And it's live, so just so you know. <laughs> Lombardo made it onto the uh, garter belt there, huh? That's Apparently, right. yes. <laughs> that's, that's a piece of work. Don't <laughs> That's good. God, these kids are so creative, man. Yes, yes, yes and, um, uh, definitely. <laughs> it gets it. This, this whole operation gets more and more creative all the time. It's amazing. <laughs> Blows <Close> my mind. <laughs> Let's see, 5.30? Yeah, I can stay up for a while. <laughs> I had to see that, though. <laughs> yeah, can't miss that one. I just met some gentleman who actually has connection with real TV producers. He's talking about inviting me to a meeting. Oh, right on. How about that, huh? You never know what's happening on your networking, man. You never know. Hey, any way to get out the word. That's, That's what right. I say. Any way to get the word out. That's right. It just shows this, this strange-looking object I have here on my stick. Draws attention left and right. It really does. <laughs> Good and bad. Good and bad People bad. wouldn't walk up and talk to me if I didn't have this in my hand. Yeah. <laughs> yeah sure. People love it. <laughs> If they did, I'd worry, so. <laughs> <laughs>
Hey, Billy. Are we having a J tonight? Just hang it out. Yeah, last I heard it's supposed to be over at 8. Yeah. Um, it's 5.32. Um, Lippy said she thought that there was something else scheduled, but she couldn't remember what. Yeah, you know, I feel like there was too, I, don't but know. I can't remember. I don't want to miss anything. <laughs> but like I say, it's scheduled to 8, and Lippy doesn't know if she'll make it, but I think I can make it. Yeah. I only have a couple of blocks to walk, so... <laughs> You so said to make it before midnight, right? The, yeah, and uh, the class was 15 bucks. Such a deal. <laughs> now, the first time I was here, I had I didn't know that this was where the march that I was in was going to end up. Right. And I marched all the way from where I parked my car at Zuccotti to here, and then they never left. And I, it's been a long time since I lived. I was a little kid when I moved out of here. And I thought, well, I'll just walk down Broadway. Well, Ike. well. I couldn't walk for almost two days afterwards. I killed myself. <laughs> so now I, I, I very carefully position my car. <laughs> Smart. And if it comes down to it, well, I'll go in a cab. <laughs> I don't want to kill myself, you know. from here down to Wall Street uh, on Tuesday for the okay. C1 action. That's a long walk. Man, I had no idea. Yeah. It's a my long was walk. I'm like, Jesus Christ. And the day they came here, that I was in that march, they didn't just come straight here. They zigzagged yeah, all the place, over right. the south, yeah. southern Manhattan That's before what they, did they came up here. Yep. So it was, instead of three FDR miles, it was like down. six miles. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but I'm getting the best shape of my life, I'm telling you. <laughs> Started to lose weight and everything. <laughs> if it wasn't for that cruise, I'd be in good shape. <laughs> Too much good doing food. Oh, oh, they gave, like, oh, the food was so good. Yeah, yeah. I have to say, uh, we went to Bermuda. Oh, nice. Yeah, I did that one. Left out of uh, the Hudson, right on 44th Street. Yeah, it was it was beautiful. It was great. And you know, I don't even care about the island. I just love being on that yeah, ship on man. the ocean. And it was rough, and I like it rough. <laughs> <laughs> My wife was just getting a little queasy, which meant it was just right for just me. Right. <laughs> Isn't it amazing, like how? Black it is out there. Oh, yeah. Right? When you look out, well, of like, course, our ship is so bright. Right. So that you have that effect, you know, you can leave them like a glow around. You can see the glow. But, but just beyond but that, yes. it's like yes. ink. Yeah, yeah, oh, and it's like man. nothing there, man. I always, I always like go to the edge and I'm like, God, can you imagine yeah. falling over? And being oh, I know. You can't thing. help but thinking that, you know. And you know that what you're looking at is a hell of a lot bigger than you think it is. Yeah. You know, we're up seven steps. So what looked like, you know, well, that wave looks big. It was actually like 12 and a half right. feet big. Because you're so high <laughs> yeah. up. It's a trip, let me tell you. But I, I loved it. It was excellent. My wife's so relaxed. She smiles oh, upon me now. That's All right. is well. That's right. That's <laughs> yeah. Cool. And then maybe in a couple of years we'll do it again, you know. We can hope, anyway. Get out, get out. That was the last little bit of my inheritance, you know. Oh, yeah? I got most of it years and years and years and years ago. I didn't even know this money existed. And they were just cleaning up the last of the estate. And all of a sudden, I had enough money to go Found on a cruise. Money. Found oh, money. Found money, yep. You yep. spend that. I had to. Right. I had to. Right. I, mean, yeah, I, I shouldn't money. have, but I did. I <laughs> and now I have a happy wife. And now you I'm, have good I, memories. I'm in a good mood. That's right. <laughs> At least until something horrible it's happens. It's a lot better than sitting <laughs> in the bank somewhere. That's a fact. That's a fact. It Absolutely. Really really Especially now that I know my son is not going to go to Rutgers. Well, you know, he's, he's smart, but he doesn't do all his homework and he gets poor grades he's not going to go to Rutgers you was know? he with you on um, Spring Awakening yes he was, yeah, I think yes, he was. Right. he's a real good kid very intelligent but doesn't do his work you yeah. know it's, it's his homework and there's a limit to how much I can do you know? I don't, how old is he he's 16 you know? and I, I don't beat children you know yeah. <laughs> you do what you can do that's all and right? I do what I can do and he may learn the hard way during uh, summer school this year we'll see He's, he's got he's got some tough grades to get past. But uh, after your Tuesday, he's gonna get the day off. Oh yeah. Come with me. It takes a lot of learning. Yeah. 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 So right after once you get that work here. Oh, you know, I was bad. You know, I didn't always do my homework. But you know what? I did enough of it to get my grades. Just to get by, right? I did enough to get good grades. Just 
No, it wasn't that hard. Yeah. He was in elementary school. He would just uh, test his way through. Oh, you yeah? can't do that in, in high school. You know? yeah. By then, they, they make you do a lot of assignments and you know, essays and all those horrible things. I have a nine-year-old daughter, and I am amazed at the amount of homework they give these kids. Oh, yeah. Uh, yeah. It's a lot more than it used to be. And they want, they want if, it was, if it was like Europe, it would be a lot more. <laughs> they, want, they want to go to a full, uh, a full year of school year. Between, you know, the homework and her social life, like her mom's got her in Boy Scouts and mm -hmm. Girl Scouts and gymnastics and all this shit, it's like, I, I don't know how they find the energy, man. I could like oh. if, there's, if there's a horrible troll there in chat, squash him. I, I should have given you, I believe you guys have the power, so you ought to be able to squash him. Uh, if not, I will make sure you have the power next time, so... <laughs> Oh. Geez, now that is well, I have my own one big crane. <laughs> Holy Moses. That's the crane they used to build the tower cranes with. Yeah, I guess so. I just, I just noticed it. It's probably been there the whole time. <laughs> well, I found one of the team. <laughs> Is that Rob? No, maybe not somebody else. Yeah, I see Rob back there. Is that Rob? Yeah. Okay, just wanted to know where one of them was. We were looking for Lippy's. We were looking for Lippy's niece. Where she was, anyway. Oh yeah. Yeah, she was. She found a friend or something, and they're wandering around, and now Lippy can't find her. And her her niece's mother is going crazy. <laughs> well, I'm just going to sort of wander for a few minutes, if you don't mind. We'll catch you later. Sort of wander around, see what there might be to see. Oh, that kind of troll. Okay. <coughs> Squash them anyway. So we have good turnout. Plenty of police. I may already, but okay. Okay. Well, come on, come on over here. Electronic harassment. I want to let you know right now that I'm live. Okay. Okay. My name is Sandy. Hi, Sandy. And I'm, uh, this is Denise. Denise. And um, we have been tortured, actually. And uh, one of the things that we're trying to educate uh, the public about for May Day on the Occupy uh, is that the NYPD currently has electromagnetic radiation in their arsenal are used against the occupiers marching and it can be very destructive for them. So we would just like to inform people there is such a weapon called electromagnetic radiation and it will be used on the, it's part of the arsenal in the NYPD to be used on the occupiers in a few days starting May 1st. Throughout the, the time that we're going to be marching and doing whatever else we're going to do in the banks and in the institutions all around the world, actually, we hope that they do not use this equipment. Certainly do. It's a no-touch feeling. Beg your pardon? It's a no-touch feeling because you don't see it, you don't hear it, and you don't smell it, but it gives you I believe you. Thank you. And they also can give you a heart attack uh, with this stuff. I mean, you've probably heard about it. Yeah, okay. Um, this is part of the equipment. I can give you this. It's really like um, basically they have kept this Rico not for right the fifty mm -hmm. and um, yeah, undercover operation. Uh-huh. And, and we've been stopping them every single time. Prisoners in my own body. I have slept for seven years and my kids we didn't know what I had. Terrible. Absolutely. 
Absolutely. Thank you very much. I'm, I'm from Occupy Earth on live stream. Live stream Occupy Earth. Let me give you a card. There you go. Whoa! <laughs> yes. As I say, this is live. 
Um, we've, you're, you've just been sent out to everybody who's watching. I don't know exactly how many, but we have a good crowd usually. So, oh my God! So you just, you yeah, just. Yeah, but I don't. Nobody wants my hair. Don't worry. It's what, it's what you say that's important. I'm telling you, it's what you say. And occupiers. Um, Okay. You know what my son is a psychiatrist, doctor, mm -hmm. and between, you know, us and uh, 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 how do you call it, the, uh, how do you call the people who are sick, mentally, or the, uh, mental patients, you know? I've been one. I guess. <laughs> <laughs> this is a matter. How I know if somebody tells me I hear voices, is it really the one who is, you know, being ill? Or is it the one who's been tortured by government with his weaponry? Because we have, they call it B2K stuff, where you actually, they talk to you. And they really have all, like, is it really true? And can you imagine that you've been, I have a, a gentleman be going now to DC to the uh, federal court again for 17 years, and I don't know, he can't the date and everything. He actually know even his uh, perpetrator. Unfortunately, I don't. I was just trying to, I'm from a different country, and when I come mm -hmm. here, America, the, the, the free. So what I did, I was very happy when we developed that two-year term for mayor in New York City. I was very happy when I walked in Washington for the, uh, for the freedom for the women for the anti-abortion. Because I really thought that's what it is. I have a limited service, which is a monopoly in this country, and monopoly is illegal. And I went to the Bill Gates when he was fighting his monopoly, Maybe you understand my action and know what I'm talking about. Today I would probably be winning like him, and maybe they would be able to help stop this. But nobody in the public to be don't realize that this is a deal with and it's not a deal with any Well, thank you for letting us know. Because uh, and I, uh, I now have information that I can look up more on, and I can spread it out there, and, and uh, we're happy to do that. As I say, you you have just said it to, to many people right now, and I will I will when I get home, I'm going to take this film, uh, this video, and I will cut out this interview and put it up separately. There is also, you know, like here in 1970, all documents. This is not a not a makeup story. This is not a balloon. Right. Do you want to give me the phone number? Oh, I can give you... I'll give you my cell phone. But you might be... Oh, 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 oh. What I'm looking for you to do, would you mind? Would you want no, to search? I have more information because I was poor. I wrote it for her. I'm more than happy to get more information. Yes, I can sure. give it to you. In fact, I tell you, the card I gave you has my email. Yeah. That would be the best if you just send it to my email address. Uh, okay. Okay. Thank you. which I took as a part time, as a you know. Then I have a ERA Enterprises, a travel agency, and Bond Realty, it's the third largest in Manhattan, which I sell also. Okay. <laughs> so, okay. So thank you. It was good to meet you. Okay. Uh, I, I understand. Yes, yes, okay. I see that. I mean, it's a lot of paper. It's okay, I'll take a look at it. Yeah, you know, because whoever the power to be... No, I, I understand. Uh, I, this is my country is turning into a fascist state. I'm watching it happen every day. So. My mother is dead. My husband is dead because of this. And this flower I gave you. What happened when he died? 
I was walking on the street and, and was really, you know, and that was the same road that he was great because he, he was a veterinary doctor in Poland. And today I am kind of, this is very emotional, very different. I understand. And, so on. and as I'm walking, I find it. That's beautiful. Thank you. You know, like, do 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 do. Thank you so much. Well, now that, my friends, is an interesting story. I have some... I'm going to have to do me some, uh, some looking, some Googling, some curiosity searching. That's just what happens. You never know who you're going to walk into. Yes, I was just about to say I'm going to save the suckers. So. Uh, we're going to save it now. <laughs>